I'm pretty sure I can confidently say that when it comes to the cans, the Mortal Kombat Ice Shatter is my number <laughs> favor. Mark my words. Hey, it's Cosmic Kate. Welcome back to my galaxy. been paying attention to G Fuel social media or even partners or community members in general of G Fuel, there are some new cans. Now supposedly they're only available in select sheets locations, which are mostly on the East Coast and I believe there are some in the Midwest as well. So if you're looking for these cans and you don't know where to look, they have a G Fuel store locator and then you can also look and see where there's a sheets near you, give them a call, figure it out. I don't know. Don't ask me where to find them though because I really do not know. I'm down here in Texas. I'm not about to drive 16 hours to the closest to Sheets in hopes that they have it. So instead, I bugged someone to do it for me. The homie Newt, who lives in New York, was able to go to Sheets and grab me one of everything. Today's video, we're just gonna review the Mortal Kombat Ice Shatter. I have a full in-depth review of the two Mortal Kombat tub flavors. If you wanna see that in-depth review, click right up here. We're gonna be tasting the Ice Shatter can and then comparing it to its tub counterpart. I'm gonna do those for each of these new cans except for the new Tetris Blast. That one came out of nowhere. Yes, I'm a G Fuel partner. Yes, sometimes I'm given a little bit of a heads up when something is happening, but these cans other than the MK11 ones, I had no idea were coming. So I'm super excited to give these a try. Let's jump right into it. My favorite part of opening a G Fuel can. Now, right off the bat, the instant comparison I can make is the caffeine amount in the powder versus ready to drink can formula. Uh, the can is, is double the caffeine. You can see right there on that baby, 300 milligrams of caffeine. And honestly, I think this is the most caffeine that is packed into a single energy drink can. I previously compared the ice shatter powder to Fresca, which is like a citrusy lemon lime kind of fizzy soda. Um, so I somewhat expect the ice shatter to taste like that, but I really don't know. The smell has me thinking so. Let's see. Oh, I, I dyed my hair, by the way. I don't, I don't know how I feel about it. This is the brightest pink I've ever had, ever. If you like Fresca, you will love this. In a lot of the older can flavors, the tubs and the cans were almost never similar in taste. And I've noticed with the past few launches, especially with Wumpa Fruit and Peach Rings, they're pretty similar. The smells are different, but I'm gonna assume that's just because they are different. I saw his shatter earlier today. This is the flavor that I'm like fixated on right now. To me, the can has a little bit more of a citrus punch in it and, and maybe that's the carbonation lending a hand to it. I would be interested to see what the powder version tastes like in a soda stream versus the can, see how different they would be. It's 8 p.m. I don't know if I wanna drink this whole thing right now. <laughs> this gets the Cosmic Kate thumbs up approval. Ice Shatter is probably in my top five for tubs and for cans, honestly. I'm pretty sure I can confidently say that when it comes to the cans, the Mortal Kombat Ice Shatter is my number one flavor. Mark my words. I haven't been able to get my hands on the Scorpion Sting one quite yet. Again, the full review for the tub versions you can find down in the description or above right here probably two of the most interesting g fuel flavors to date especially the scorpion sting i say it tastes exactly like a manganata so i'm curious to see how that translates over to a can i'm super excited to do a video on that for you guys and let you know what, what i think like I mentioned, I'm down in Texas. I don't have immediate access to these can launches, unfortunately. So there's a lot of partners that are uh, on the East Coast and near Sheets locations or have access to these through other people. 
and I just I can't I can't be that quick about it and I'm so 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 sorry because I would love to provide that content for you but don't worry I'll get everything as soon as I can about 99% of the stuff I buy myself so and I'm just I, I want to keep doing that to be able to do this so be sure to hit that subscribe button like comment do all the things let me know you're enjoying what i'm doing or if you don't enjoy it let, like that's fine but thank you so much for joining me today i'll see you on the next one where we review some more cans bye